fellow soldiers achieved for all of humanity. Also here with us today is Lauren Matthews, the granddaughter of a Battle of the Bulge veteran who has since passed away. His name was Master Sergeant Roddy Edmonds. Like so many of our veterans, Roddy never talked about the war. Laura never knew her grandfather's story until she embarked upon a school project about 10 years ago. Roddy was in the 422nd Regiment, which was overwhelmed when the Nazis launched their surprise assault. He and his men fought for three treacherous days before being taken as prisoners of war. After they arrived at a prison camp, the German commander sent an order over the loudspeaker. The Jewish American soldiers were all told to step out of line during roll call the next day. Knowing the terrible fate that would come to his Jewish comrades, Roddy immediately said, we're not doing that. He sent orders to have every American step out of line with their Jewish brothers in arms. The next morning, 1,292 Americans stepped forward. The German commander stormed over to Roddy and said, they cannot all be Jews. Roddy stared right back. He said, we are all Jews here. At that point, the German put a gun to Roddy's head and demanded, you will order the Jews to step forward immediately or I will shoot you right now through the head. Roddy responded, Major, you can shoot me, but you'll have to kill us all. Something. The German turned red, got very angry, but put his gun down and walked away. Master Sergeant Edmonds, saved 200 Jewish Americans, soldiers that day so proud to be Jewish and so proud of our country. Lauren, thank you for being here today as we remember your grandfather's unbelievable and exceptional valor. Lauren, please stand up. Thank you very much. One of the 200 Jewish American soldiers who were saved that fateful day is Staff Sergeant Lester Tanner. Lester is now 96 years old. And he joins us here. Boy, you guys are looking very good, 96. Lester, you're really 96, Lester? I don't believe it. You're looking good. Thank you very much. Thank you also for your very noble service and for sharing this incredible story with the world. Thank you very much, Lester. The men and women who have donned our nation's uniforms are the bravest, toughest, strongest, and most virtuous warriors ever to walk